Bryce Young was the safest quarterback in the draft. He was also the smallest. So far, the Panthers have gotten little return on a big investment. Young ruled out for Sunday's game at the Seahawks. He's currently 31st in yards, 26th in QBR, right behind the Jets' Zach Wilson. Not what you were hoping for out of the number one overall pick. No one seems to know where or when the injury happened, and my spidey senses are tingling. Listen to this interaction with offensive coordinator Thomas Brown. I don't know. Sometime in the first half. First half. Did I can pinpoint a play or, you know, when, is that, when it actually happened. Did you at halftime or no. not? Yeah. Never said a one word the whole game. Did you notice that at all in that 26 yard run? No, it looked good to me. So, I mean, he had a little, little bob and weave, wing and stick off the foot. Made a nice little cut, so no, there's no indication in my mind. Yeah, I think anytime you have a guy that completes the entire game and, and uh, doesn't complain or talk about an injury, you kind of sometimes get surprised by it, but. Um, I've never questioned his toughness when it comes to mental toughness for sure, but also physical toughness also. So uh, we'll, we'll keep it moving. They aren't questioning his toughness, but I wonder if the organization is questioning his readiness. Feels like this ankle injury could be a convenient excuse to give their franchise QB a little reset. The rap on Young is that he didn't have the physical tools to be an elite QB. His strength was his poise, his instincts, and his decision making. Doesn't have the speed and size of Anthony Richardson or the arm of C.J. Stroud. He's more Drew Brees than Russell Wilson, and that's going to take time to develop. Question is, was that really worth trading up to get the number one overall pick? Not only did they give up D.J. Moore in the deal, a receiver Young desperately could use, they traded next year's first-round pick. The hope was that Young could take this team to the playoffs year one. Now there's no reward if this season goes into the tank. Owner David Tepper has been double and tripling down on quarterback. Eventually, the house has to collect. So maybe a change in the dealer is what this team needs. Andy Dalton starts in Seattle. Young rests his ankle and his head. The future rests on his slight shoulders, and they cannot afford to lose this bet.